guys back in off Penjab Let's Play and Penjab. It's either Penjab or Penjab. It's one of those two. I think it's probably Penjab. Penjab's probably the most likely of houses in it, but Penjab is pretty cool. Alright, so as you guys know, last episode we decided to, you know, start um, influencing Persia to our advantage. And we got another event, which we could also get foreign leadership training and modifiers giving us, like, the most advanced armies to be... To be, uh, our troops are now the finest in the world, leader modifier. Um, this would actually be more helpful, to be honest with you. Okay, because this is, we're actually going to be conquering here soon. So having all four of these, you know, modifiers will definitely give us a boost to our, to our war effort. So anyways, as we all know, we are going to begin the, uh, infamy gain of, of Persia. I'm... Hoping that no one has Persia in the sphere right now. Let's check that out. I should have checked that. Yes, no country really. Oh, Russia. No. No. Shoot. Okay. We cannot fight Russia. That just stinks. That just flat out stinks. That's unfair in a little bit, in a ways. That we are prevented from doing anything because Russia decided to be an imperialistic power and take over. So, well, I know indirect, oh, I know, actually this is even better, to be honest with you, Khalid. Okay. I'm going to actually cancel our Kazakh's ballet with Persia. Let me go to justification, cancel it. That's just not going to work. Um, and what we're going to do is we're going to try to annex Bakura. I bet you guys are thinking, why would we annex Bakur? It's like a pathetic little nation that really does not have any resources whatsoever to give us anything. I know. But what Bakur does have is an alliance with Russia. Which is what we need. So we need to go to war f with them for one of the most stupidest reasons I always consider in this game. Make a Actually, make a puppet would actually be very beneficial for future... Hmm. Humiliate. Humiliate might also be a good one. Gives us a hundred infamy. It would be a good modifier, so we wouldn't have to. So let's see. So our military might you know, that increases our prestige while lowering theirs. Okay. Again, make the puppet would actually be much better if I'm thinking about this really, really generally. I mean, um, it really. I think in the long run this would be a better. But yeah, I don't want the infamy for this just in case. Cause it'd be really stupid infamy if I. But could it be such a ah? This is one of my indecisive moments. I don't know. Never mind. Who it? No one's gonna be influencing Bakura, so I probably won't gain any infamy. And I bet I'm gonna regret those words. But I'm just gonna go with Mega Puppet because you know I want something valuable if I do win this. So, anyways, what we're gonna do is we're basically gonna bait Perger into this war. Basically, what's gonna happen is that they're gonna they're gonna get their butt kicked. I'm gonna be like, oh no, we but that we they're gonna be like, oh no, we those nasty Panabians declared war. Goodbye, labor. Expel the barbarians. No, that'd be a very that'd be a very bad idea. Let's go goodbye labor. So oh great. Is this gonna give us a bad modifier for our economy? Because we already have a bad economy. So once the wind of westernization blows to the east, every blade of grass and every tree in the east follow what the western wind brings. Where call them comes the strange things I've transpired transpired recently. Off our coastline, strange ships have been appearing. Strange ship with masts so tall as to seem to touch the sky, the face of God. At first, a curiosity soon, ever so often increasing in insanity, a gale grows, the storms and tomorrow. Strange are their shapes, and stranger still are the customs. But there can be no doubt that we must adopt a policy with regards to the forwards from the Europe. Well, goodbye. Le whore? What does that mean? Penub gets... We need that, actually. I may damage our economy, but we need that. So, anyways, this is that's basically my genius plan. So I'm going to have Bakura basically declare war. And that actually does... Oh, wow, that, that was nice. Not much. And I'll use their army in the future to go take over more of, of these guys. But for right now, we need to just gain them. So, anyways... Um, what we need to start doing is preparing for this war, and I think Khalid, my two ally allies right there, will join in. Okay. Because it's not that powerful of people, so let's see. Make Puppet, and I know Khalid could turn against me, but 
So unlikely, impossible, maybe. You guys are the worst alliance I've ever made in my entire lives. I seriously think you guys should all go die in your own individual hell. Because you guys, honestly, do not want to go to war with me. Because why? Okay. I probably just spent a couple infamy points for nothing. So let's see, I could potentially be up against an even more powerful threat with two, potentially two big gigantic armies going, three big gigantic armies beating down my butt. Um, if all these guys leave me, then, well, we will see. If all these guys leave me, we will see. I'm going with it, though. So let's see. Seems like they weren't honest. The only person that joined me was Sid. Good job, Sid. I trust you more than I ever trust anyone else. In fact, you redeemed yourself for not joining the original Afghanistan war. But now it's time for a little bit of... Cheatery. Okay. So now that we have declared war and we now know the fronts, it's basically me versus all of this. Which is not an easy prospect to take on. So, um, basically I thought I was going to be doing this war to just, um, get, a uh, you know, sheep alliance with Bakur. But apparently, I'm probably going to have to fight this for my own survival. Which I don't mind, but this was kind of useless in my own retrospect. So, we're just going to start defending our own nation. Okay, you guys stay right here. We don't need you guys yet. Okay, so we're just going to have to use our own advantages of the sky and land to our... The utmost importance. So, the Bakurians should come in with their powerful army. We're going to try to destroy as many as we can. Yeah, they're going to probably move in right there. Um, we want to get, where's our best supply, okay, we're going to have to supply our men, by the way. Supply our men to the utmost, and I know this is going to tax my military, and my economy. Hey, we actually have some aristocrats in our country. That's kind of, I mean, not aristocrats, um, what are these? Like, who's getting the luxurious needs? Oh, clergymen. We actually have clergymen in our country. That's kind of awesome. Okay, but, um, what we're going to do is, um, keep this army actually right here. Okay, let's see how am I going to do this. Alright, I'm going to move this army right here. I'm going to move this army right there. Okay. What we're going to do is we're going to keep a good lookout for Bakurian, Bakurian um, armies. And we're basically waiting for them to take the maximum amount of nutrition they'll get. So we can go in and go take them out. Persia is really where everything goes in. And they're going exactly to the place I wanted them to go. Yes! Okay, that should take them like so long to conquer. Alright, that'll give us... Maybe enough time to do what I want to do. Okay. Um, the immediate threat is the Bakurin army right there. Not the Bak Yeah, the Bakurin army right there. Uh, I'm kind of worried about these armies, but I could easily take these on. Khalid, Sadar is actually a great alliance for me right now. The rest of these guys aren't. Um, dang, this is actually going to take a lot of my infamy. Like, just a lot. This is... I didn't want this, but apparently I'm going to have to get it. Well, we could always go to war with Persia in future years. It's not like this is going to be an end-all, be-all strategy. Okay. So, do we want to attack right now? Um, well, what we, I think what we should do is hit out this army. Because that actually be a smarter choice. Take out this army right here. So that we have, you know, them dead. Okay. Are they retreating? No. Okay, now that we have them both dead, now we use both these two armies to hit this army. Because we need to make sure they do not conquer. Okay. They're retreating, and I'm going to move my army right over here. Yeah, you you go back. You Yeah, you're not going to be able to escape even if you try. My army may be a little bit late, but... Okay, and we made them lose a little bit more of their men. I have more soldiers coming in. Okay, we're losing a lot more, but now, with the du we doubled men. Okay. Okay, you guys go chase them back. Okay, let's see. How are we doing in terms of Persian conquest? Alright, they seem to have most of this area defected. I'm... Um, kind of not surprised that was kind of given that I would lose all this area um Sadar's doing actually a pretty good job of taking out these guys which is actually a good job because you know if we take out the entire regions over here well you know just by uh <laughs> them just doing whatever they're doing then we could possibly win this because then we could probably peace out these guys you know because I bet they don't even want to be in this war I'm getting I'm guessing they don't um they don't want to be in this war no, they do want to be in this war. They definitely do want to fight me. But maybe what we could do later is just, like, do something. So I'm going to get back into my usual place. Try to start healing my orders. 
We need to make sure that we have a good sized orders. Fight fight the disease by any means, okay. Um We have basically not a very strong start. We have no supplies coming to us. Um this is not the best blast. Okay. So we have we have taken over the upward parts of Peneb, which is a good a good thing. The question now becomes, do we attack this place? And I don't think we do. Um, we need to wait for them to have a little bit more um, modifiers to them, I guess is the best way, before we go attacking them. Because otherwise, we're going to die. I can always see it. They have way more powerful alliances than we do. Okay, Sada has a very good control over most of this part. I really wish, you know, the one reason I guess I really do want that alliance is that or that main conquest thing is that it will give us a chance to uh, control the commands and having an army like that which may not seem like much is actually a very good amount because then I control like basically if I take over their army I control the rest of this because I'm like now holding on my own against all these other guys okay and if I take over just a little bit of the land that should be enough for um, the war of my fight not go down and Sid wants to go fight which is good I'm gonna go back over here um, okay, this is actually a safe spot. Hit them both at the same time. Because that's actually, no, that's actually a safe spot. And you guys are wondering what that guy mean. Well, they're both going to be hit. Okay, Khalid wants to get out of this war now. Cut Khalifa down the sides. Did somebody add that war goal? Oh, Sid, that's a nice war goal. I like that. Uh, they receive, they, uh, they receive an offer from a piece from Khalid. Is that the war, if they are the war leader, please tell me they're not the war leader. They are the war leader, and they're probably... No. No. Okay. Wait, I'm going to save it right now. Okay, I didn't mean to do that. I'm going to save it right now, because I'm not sure... I'm not sure if that was a peace deal for, like, them or for somebody else. Let me see. Peace deal, they will accept this offer. Let's see. If it ends the war, then I'm going to get out of it. Okay, no, no, no. It just gets Khalid out of the war. Okay, that's actually good. Because then that means now we're only dealing with Persia. Which Persia, as we all know, is a very powerful enemy. And I just defeated one of their armies. I feel really happy. Yeah, th this army just got destroyed. Okay, so now you guys move in right there. You guys, try to go heal yourself. You guys are definitely dying at a very, very rapid late rate. Rate? Is that the word? Yes, rate. So you guys just go heal yourself. Okay, now we have to worry about that other death stack of Persian glory right over there. Um, um, I'm gonna help my friend here get this uh, this uh, conquest done with because we actually do need this way quicker than I thought because it's going to. Uh, dang, I hate when my armies just like get all pathetically unpowerful. I think it's because we are supplying way too much. My armies can't honestly take it. So what would happen if I just decrease education? Like to the utmost, just decrease it. We can lose a couple of days of education. I'm, I'm going to lose this in the long run. But we can lose a couple of days of education if we... Okay, we can increase that too. Okay. So let's see. That should actually help our economy just a little bit. Okay. Okay. Um, no, 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 no. You. The city. No, city. I need you guys to come help. Uh... Dang, my other army's not ready. My other army's not ready to go take over more stuff. Um, Sid, can I please take over your army right now? This would be... We could definitely end the war if you guys give me your... Oh, dang it. I can't get military. Hi. Okay. Well, I do have a little bit of Bakur, so my war goal should not be weighing off. Yeah. This should not be weighing off. Um, We basically have a... Uh, not a stalemate, but a... Hail mate, I guess is the best way to put it. And okay. So that Persian army is gonna heal slightly. Which we probably could have ended this right now, Sid, if you guys had just listened to me, but I don't have enough army men. Great, now they're going back in their territory. That means hopefully maybe they're gonna go after the uh city and troops. Acidic troops. Uh Sida troops these guys' troops. Maybe then we can go in and go um take a little bit more of their their thing. Um we should actually be worrying about the upper armies over there. Why do you guys never hear when I want you guys to? Seriously. Okay, how about you guys go to Lahore and try to start gathering up an army over there? Because we actually do need some good reserves. Okay, the drums are war. Peneb gains a human... What? 
Why is it always against the UK? Why is it always against the UK? I will never declare war on the... Okay. Shoot. I completely forgot about you guys. I don't think... No, I'm not going to make it. Well, I gave you guys an option. You guys you guys belligerently disobeyed me. So I don't... I, I really don't feel bad if you guys get conquered or get defeated. Honestly. I'm just going to stay right here and see if I can protect them. Okay. So let's see. They're going after my little... Okay, yeah. They're afraid of me. They're definitely afraid of me, which is good. We want to make sure we keep doing this. Okay, they're going straight after me. Okay. Okay. I don't... I'm just dancing with them right now. I'm not really wanting to get into engagement because I know I'm not the the most strongest right now in terms of engagement because this army right here is just basically a dead man. Okay. Is there any way we can... I know I always do this. But is there any way we can just make a new army and just, like, destroy the old army? Yes, there's always a way. So let's see. Just keep making... Make an entirely new army... Okay, yeah, there we go. That should be strong enough if we do make it to fight against the uh, Persians. <sighs> if only you had just lent me your hand and your army, I probably could have won this for you guys. But no, you guys didn't, so that happened. Okay, well, I'm going to go. Oh, good. Ah, that is so... If only, if only they would... Uh... If only, if only these guys would be realizing that I would love to take these guys on and destroy them. If only, if only they'd realize I know how to defeat them. Yes, I do now. That did not rhyme at all and did not go together cohesively in terms of a sentence and a structure of poetry. But I really don't care because I'm really mad right now because I could definitely take these guys on and take them out if I had this army with me. But the Indians decide, hey, no, let's not help you guys out. Hey, I actually get you guys in on the... <laughs> hey, would you like to form an alliance and, you know, be on this war that you guys just entered out of and were on my side? Um, the Persians, I don't know if we're going suicide kamikaze, but they don't, that's not a very smart idea. If I attacked them, well, if I attacked them right here, this is, let's see. Let's just see what happens when I attack them. I'm gonna lose the rest of my army, I already know it. That's what's gonna happen. That's what's gonna happen. But you know what? I want to kill as many as I can. What? No way. Come on. Kill. 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 Everyone chant with me. Kill. Yes. Yes. Oh, shoot. Now I got another army. But that's actually weaker. Okay, we're just going to have to keep hitting them. That's the only way we're going to win this. Now that we have almost all the men underneath that one stupid cloud, we have to destroy it. And I know this is going to kill me. This is going to hurt me. Oh my goodness, this is this is gonna be a close this is not gonna be a close battle because I'm in open planes. No, we're still hitting much more modifiers than they are. Uh come on, yes! Yes, okay. Chase them. Do not let them do not let them heal. I repeat, do not let them heal. We have to chase them down like dogs in a big gigantic dog pit. Okay, yes, 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 yes! We just defeated the Persian army! Oh what? What? Oh, I hate you. I hate you very much. You, you know that, don't you? You know that. Okay. It, that's okay, though. That's okay. We haven't... That That's manageable. That's not like... This This is all manageable. This isn't like complete another death, death warrants because... Um... You know, once the Sid troops finish their weird... Okay. Should I attack these guys right now? Let's do it. We want to make sure these guys do not heal. And if they, uh, oh, come on, where do they keep getting all these, like, little one, one-liner troops? Well, those guys are going to have really bad infamy. Okay, and, dang it, I'm, I'm like, ah, oh, shoot, now I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Mm-hmm. Yep, that was a bad, oh, 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 you're dead. Haha, -ha, you're dead. You're dead. Go kill them. Go kill them, Sid troops. Go kill them. Go get revenge for my troops that just died. And for the lack of luster, I don't even care for them. Okay, I'm going to go move you guys over there. Because you guys are actually pretty useless if you guys aren't actually conquering. Okay, yes! Oh, yeah. Oh, so Persia, how was that army you guys had? Uh, yeah, I, I think it went something like death. Death and destruction. Okay, yeah. Now we're kicking. I defeated the Persians without even really doing anything. All I did was just, like, do a little bit of tiny stuff. And... We already had a little bit of it conquered, so we don't have a real good war modifier. 
Um, Utah, yep, the Americans are conquering Utah again. Liberous nation of Lebanon, okay. As usual, these are kind of usual things that happen in the game. Nothing out of the ordinary. Um, I'm kind of waiting for my, are my troops actually building or are they just like sitting there? They're sitting there because I don't have enough money to actually do any of the buildings I want to. Which I think to actually gain any of the infamy I'm going to need. I don't even think if I like decreased everything to up to like the minimum. Actually, we can probably decrease my army to a little bit because you know what? They angered me. Because <laughs> they can't even, they can't even like, okay. There we go. That should be actually a good amount of money. So they're actually making money. So they're actually making the soldiers and actually getting the ammo and stuff. Which is something we actually do need. Mm hmm. Yeah, we can we can we we can um, lower spending for a little bit to gain all the small arms and stuff. So that might actually be more effective. Ah, dang it! Seriously, you, you guys just don't give up. Well, you guys aren't gonna conquer my land, and you're definitely not gonna conquer my fort with that. Trust me. Okay. Well, the Sidonian troops should be on it. No, they're actually just gonna go up and conquer. I don't have enough army to actually fight against the Persians right now. Yeah, there's like enough Persians if they would actually all combine to actually be a threat to me. Which is not a good idea. Okay. Who wants an alliance with me? Macron. What's Macron? They're a terrible alliance. I can only tell you that. Um, Persian. Oh, Ottoman Empire, though. They sound like good alliance. They don't want to be in alliance with me. So that'd be a very bad alliance. You guys. Would you like an alliance? No. You guys think I'm way too powerful and greedy? No, you hate my infamy. Well, infamy is not that bad. Trust me. I've had way worse games. Um... Khalid would be a really terrible person to add into this game. I, I guarantee they would not last long. Um, I'm, I'm beginning to worry because I don't have control over this city and army. Which is my main problem right now. Which is one of the problems I think in this game was... Oh man, I always... Somehow I always get into one of the problems of this game. Is that the fact they added a command unit thing. But yet they did not add a reason for... If you're the leader, you should be able to control these guys' army. I mean, honestly, you should be. This... I don't know. So many things. There's so many things. Okay. Yeah, they would not. They would not go against the allies. These guys might. Hmm. Anyone else I can add into this war to maybe tip it? Oh yeah, Russia. Russia, would you like to join me? No. Yeah, that's why I thought. I don't think Russia is one of those type to be uh trying to fight. Okay, come on, Sid. Please realize that you guys are conquering the wrong things. Go and take those armies out. We need to do it while they're still weak. They are pushing in. They actually have decent sized armies right now. Ah, uh, I can't even do anything about it. Find my army. Oh, do I have some of my troops being made over here? Okay, we have approximately one troop being made. That's not too bad. Okay, hopefully the rest of these troops are gonna come quickly because we need. Yeah, they're all gonna they're all gonna pop up about the same time. That's good, and then we'll just. Combine these guys. Okay, good. Sid does realize that having a big gigantic um, force of of um, Persians is not a good thing. Dang, but then they just destroyed one of my own armies. But good thing I still got another decent amount. And I'm actually making a decent sized army. And we're going to conquer the Bakurian capital. Oh, my goodness. Okay. This is still... It, it, I, I honestly thought this was end game, but like I said, this could still go any way. I mean, it says we have nine war score, but this could still go any way. Either way. Okay, um... Any mass recruiting we could do, like, over here, because this would actually be... Okay, we have lots of places we could build some recruits. Okay, build some more Saidi Peneb men. Build some more of these guys. Build some more of these guys. Build some more... I'm just gonna build, like, a ton of people over here, because they're, it's gonna... Even if... No matter how long they take, it's going to take them a really long time to get over here, so... I'll just build as many as I can. Yeah, because I bet you by the time those armies are done, maybe we could have a chance against the Persians. And if Sid actually gets that button to gear and actually realizes the more important aspect of where you actually need to conquer. And not this. This is stupid. This is, like, really just stupid. I mean, you don't conquer that part. Seri seriously? That's, like, the stupid part to conquer. <sighs> Well, anyways, my army is actually getting strong. Um, by the time, I think when they're done, we could probably go take them on a little bit more effectively. Because, okay. Let's see, combine them all. Who's the best general? That better be the best general. Okay. 
Um, I'm gonna go take out some of these small armies. Because unlike Sid, Sid, Sid is almost done though. That's a good thing, is that Sid's almost done with all this conquest. So once they're done with this conquest, then we can, um, move in and go start taking over more of Khalid. And I do like the fact that we did cut these guys down to size. So if I really wanted to go take him out for, for betraying me, I can. Which I probably will do. Because I don't like when, when nations betray me. Okay, you know what? Actually move over here. Cause we, yeah, there we go. I just had to de, 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 um, stabilize the siege. Actually, we do have enough army to just go take these guys on directly. Do I want to, though? Eh. We all die hard, so everyone chant with me at the same time. Die! 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 Come on, die! No, don't die! Don't die! I said not me! Not me! Good job! That's exactly what we needed. Okay, now you guys go charge him. Well, I have really low morale. <laughs> um, but... We died. Oh, wait. We did kill a lot. So, let's see. Where are my city and troops? They are not helping. But they are helping in a different way. All right. There we go. Okay. So, we are finally on the offensive. And I have more army men over here. I'm just going to make... I'm just going to combine you guys in Lahore. G just start making whatever you need. Okay. And... Wow. Okay. We're finally on the offensive against the uh, uh, Persians. It took us a good amount of time. Like, a good amount of time. I mean, we've destroyed their army. I would love to add more war goals against them now. Okay, acquire state. Yeah, definitely. I have enough time now so I can start adding war goals. Let's see. Um, What region do I want? I want this region right here. And I guess my plan d definitely does work in the end. Ah, that's no, that's actually what I've been planning this entire time. Okay, so I want this region right here. So this is the uh, Koshian, Kol, Gashian. What? I, I can't say it. But this region right over here, I want that region. Kyrgyzstan, Khorashrian region. Yes, I want that. Oh, shit. Well, that's going to be a really bad thing. But at least we'll gain a region out of this. So it, it will be worth it in the end. And we'll gain these guys as our puppets. Which so then we can use it. That's just unfair. That's just flat out unfair. They declared war on me. No, it wasn't the reverse. They declared war on me. Right. Well, this is actually one of those points where I'm going to have to go back and reverse it. And, um, if we were to actually fight this out, I have no doubt we would lose. So I'll see you guys in a little bit when I reverse the time.